What is up guys and welcome back. Okay, so in this video we're going to be slaughtering the legendary bull gator and he is a mammoth creature and you're going to find him or her just to the southwest of La Grasse. He's chilling right there. Now this was one of the first ones I did, the first legendaries to be honest. Um, I, did, I left them for a later stage of the game. So at this point I wasn't even sure on the clues that you have to find. But I learned fairly quickly that you actually have to follow the clues. And uh, this seems obvious now, but back then it was early days. Okay, so in this direction, I saw one gator and I wasn't actually sure. And I was like, no, that can't be it. Obviously it wasn't. You won't even need the focus to see this guy. Okay, so what you want to do actually is swing around to my left. And then in the distance, you will see the actual first clue right over there. So I'm going to head across there and inspect the clues. There it is. Now with this you can create a quite cool vest as well as some boots and a, a trinket and I'm going to show you all of those Still at the end. Well this is part of the ingredients you need for those certain uh, trinkets and talismans. So we're going to head on over to the second inspection. This thing is pretty much a walking tank, very slow, very easy to spot, and very easy to kill actually, but um, I didn't want to just shoot it from 50 feet away, I wanted to give it a fighting chance, but it started acting stupid, so it ended. Okay, so the third one is going to be over here, and then he's going to be just behind the tree stump on the left. And you'll spot him right through the trunks there. Absolute monster. A 50 million year old prehistoric creature. And we're going to make some boots and a vest out of him. One thing I didn't do is obviously you must track the animal, study it to tick those boxes, but then also check the information because then it gives you an idea of what weapons you need to use or the best ones for the perfect skin. Even though with this animal, the uh, perfect skin doesn't count because it's just legendary skin and there he is so I try to get as close as possible crazy scary creature there it is I actually recommend saving your game and uh, having a look at some of the death scenes with him it's actually quite brutal so I did one shot and that just pissed him off Run away, and then always to the rescue, the sword off. But again here, he started acting weird, so I'm like, okay. Noodles. There we go, fairly easy one. Not too difficult to track or to kill, but an amazing creature nonetheless. Okay, skin time. Now I've been asked to show the skinning because it is actually quite interesting, as gruesome as it is. There it is. I wish you could bring a cart over here and take that back to your house and uh, have meat for a month. Although it'll probably spoil in a couple of days. But there it is. And here's where you can find lots of information in your compendium. What I was saying earlier about weapon types and that kind of shit. So as per usual, stow your cargo. Do not drop it like this. But we're going to skip ahead now to the That's trapper, no is it? No, nope, this much. is the fence. And again, you can find these guys easily with the index on your map. And over here, you get some of the items that can be crafted. Alligator talisman. I just hope nobody's missing this. Then, head over to the trapper. And this is where we can get our vest and boots. Nothing quite like wearing your best day's work. Let's head to garment sets and then the death roll. And in here, you're going to find the options to purchase. You can make multiple items because it is quite a large skin. But like most, most animals, you can use the legendaries more than once. I think <laughs> at this stage, you must be able to because you can craft different things. Okay, 
that is going to bring us to the end of the video guys hope you find it informative you're able to have a look at this amazing beast uh plenty more guides on the way any questions you have just ask always going to answer so i want to say thanks for watching and i want to catch you on the next one